Let's just get this show on the road. Hey guys, and today is another day. Yes, it is. And if you already have read the title, well, you, should, you would have read the title, otherwise you might not have wanted to click on this video. But today I'm going to be showing you Tanya Burr's new cosmetic range. I was so excited, she just dropped this all on us like a bombshell last Wednesday and literally I I was out at the time and I saw her tweet and I was like, I kind of just like had a little mini like, what? Like, oh my gosh! There was no warning, it was just, right, my cosmetics are out and they're online right now. And I was freaking out. There's only three lip glosses in this range, three nail polishes and two eyeshadow palettes. The lip glosses and the nail polishes are all matte and that's, oh, as soon as I found that out, that was like, right, it's an immediate purchase. I've literally just got home from work. My Feel Unique order has arrived. I ordered the eyeshadow palettes and the lip glosses from Feel Unique and ordered the nail polishes from Superdrug because I kind of, worked it all out and it worked out cheaper that way. I don't know, but that's what I did. Now, I haven't done a Tanya Burr cosmetics review impressions before, I don't believe. When her first range came out, they came out whilst I wasn't even on YouTube at that time, at that point in time. However, now I am, so I thought I really wanted to do this. And since there's not that many things in the range, I thought it was perfect to do a short little video for you guys. Enough of me rambling, let's just get on with it. With my super drug order, I got a free one of these, no filter needed. I don't really use these, they just give them out for free and I'm just like, I'm not gonna use it that much. I might use it. I use it for my brushes when I go travelling. There's an idea. The nail polishes, I am loving this packaging, but I noticed on the on the nail polishes that they don't have the little Tanya signature hearts on the lids. I'm not too fussed about it, but it just kind of feels like it's missing something. The nail polishes are called New Chapter, which as soon as I saw it, I was like, I really am looking forward to this. I saw the nail polishes and I was like, New Chapter looks right up my street. And Tanya Burr's Duvet Day is like my favorite nail polish. So this could be my next new chapter. Get it? No? That, well, that's, yeah. As with the other ones, the lids do come off like this. I haven't had a look at the colors yet. Ooh, I like it. New chapter has a very, very similar color payoff, or it looks that way, as Duvet Day, with a bit of taupe shade thrown into there. I think it's a taupey, a taupey grey, which I am loving. The next one is Piggy Bank, and to me, this was my least favourite. I'm not really a big fan of pink, but I am interested to see what this looks like. Um, but I do love this pink. This is a very nice pink. It is, it is a very piggy pink, should we say. I think it's almost the same colour as this. Yeah, it pretty much is. So if you get this, you know what that looks like. I think it's very pretty. It's not gorgeous, it's pretty. It's pretty pink, that's what it is. This is another one that I was like, hmm, I wonder if that's gonna be like um, Do A Day as well. This is the one that I, when, when she showed the pictures, this is the one where I was just kind of like, that looks so nice. I do not have a, a nail polish that looks anything like this one. But this one, I believe, is kind of a, um, a plummy taupe purple, I think. Let's just have a little look. Yes, it's exactly what I thought. I really like that. I really, really like that. I can see myself using soft pyjamas and... I forgot the names already. Soft pyjamas and new chapter a lot. A lot, a lot. Even mixed together. I think all three of these colours would look really nice together actually and I'm holding that middle one the wrong way around. So, yeah. Loving them. Now we're going to go to the unboxing. Let's, I have cut my nails but they have a, a strip on it so I can pull it off. Oh yes. So clever. There they are. Well packaged. That is like the best kind of packaged package I have actually seen from Phil Uni. Loving it. Now let's get into it. That is a different Ooh. Oh no wait, this might be a little easier than I thought because it's kind of like stretches. La 
sunglasses. The one that I was a bit iffy about is the Puppy Paws, again because it's like a really really pink, like a pale pink. Actually it won't be too bad, not so, but then again I'm not so sure how it would look like when it turns to matte, because that's the thing, they're all matte. But the two I was like, oh my gosh, I have to get, especially this one especially, Martha Moo. This shade looks stunning. I cannot wait to try that. And then this one, what is this one called? Rhubarb and Custard. I love the name of this. Okay, right. I'm going to open the puppy, puppy Paws first. Let's take the wrapper off. I forgot to mention that these packages are frosted. So hence the matte, compared to your glossy ones where you're just a bit like, where they're glossy I guess. But yeah, I re I'm really loving this packaging. Let's just, I need a mirror, let me get a mirror. I need a mirror. Ooh, oh my gosh. That is really pink. That is really pink guys. Wow, that looks super pink on the camera. Like a Barbie pink, guys. Ooh. Wow. My lips are like pinked out. Oh this doesn't really go with my like bronzy face right now. This is Barbie pink. This is really Barbie pink. It also, it also kind of like, um, what's the pink? Who wears this kind of Nicki Minaj? Oh, this is a, like a really Nicki Minaj lip. I'm not sure, guys. Maybe it would look better with something on top of it, but I'm getting a really like, I don't know if you can see that. I should probably zoom in so you can see. Can you see that kind of like lip there? It's like creating a line, a really like fine line. But that is just super pink. It looks kind of cute, but I'm not sure if I would wear it that much. Yeah, I think I'd wear like mix it with something else. I don't think I'd wear this on its own, but that is really pink. Really pink. I know who wouldn't like this. My best friend wouldn't like this. I had some trouble trying to get that off. I'm not gonna lie, it took forever. Next, we're gonna try rhubarb and custard. And as you can see, puppy paws have literally rubbed my lips dry. They smell like NYX, I'm not gonna lie, they smell like NYX. It's that almondy, buttery smell. I can't describe what the fragrance is. It goes, it feel, it goes on really nice, like a gloss. It goes on just like NYX, but doesn't come off like NYX. I actually like this one. This one's not too bad. I think this is the kind of lips that um, you would have to put like a moisturiser on before or even just like scrub. I like this one. I really like this one. I could wear that one on its own. Really well custard. It looks cute with this outfit actually. It really does. Last one. Be back in a moment. I'm gonna take this bad boy off. I'm back guys. We're back. We're back. Okay. Fast lip gloss. I'm excited about this one. So Martha Moon, I really want this one to look good because it really looks nice. It just looks like it's for me. Should we say? Oh my gosh, yes. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yep. This is just so me. This is actually my lips. Same shade as my lips, but just a better, like a little bit pinkier. Oh, I love it. I love, love, love this one. Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. It's a bit sticky whilst it's drying, but once you let it dry, it's fine. You don't even know or feel like you've got a matte a lip on. Oh, I love this one. I love loving this colour. Love it. Right. I'm going to keep this on and we're going to move on. Next are the beautiful palettes. These look absolutely gorgeous. I think this one might be my favourite out of the two, 
but we'll see. I always forget they have tape on these things. Urgh, come off. Okay, this is where I need my nails. Ooh, oh, I like this. I like this, guys. This is not at all how I expected this to look. And each of these colours are like filled to the brim. My other ones weren't filled to the brim. Not as much as this anyway. I'm loving these shades. Okay, so we have marzipan, toast up here. I think there's a lip gloss called toast. And then down here we have cocoa sugar and soft truffle. I really like these. This is kind of like the brown version of the Hollywood palette, the gold one. Um, and I found that in the Hollywood palette, palette, the Hollywood palette, the shade down here, I think it's like gold, gold mine, I think it's called, or maybe it's something like that. But that has a lot of fallout. I'm hoping this one doesn't have that much fallout, but I really like this. This palette would go really nice with my lip. It really would. Ooh. Ooh. I thought the tones would be actually deeper in this palette. So this one, I'm, I'm not even telling you what they're called. So that one's called Birthday Suit, a birthday suit, and this one, this purpley one, is called Enchanted Dream. Okay, so we have two shimmery shades, or should we say, they're more like, like iridescent, pearly, pearlized, pearlized shades, um, and we have two matte shades. I love these shades. I think these two palettes together are my favourite. I only have them two of the original palettes, which is the Galaxy palette and the Hollywood palette. I never got the other one, but I really do want to get it now. So the shades we have is Moonlight Walk, which would be perfect for highlighting the inner corner or under the eyebrow, or even just like a highlight in the middle of the um, eye, you know, just to give it a like, wash of colour. Then we have the Cocoa Plum. Love that colour. Berry Souffle and Magic Carpet. I just, all these tones together would make the perfect taupey eye, should we say, or plummy eye, taupey plummy eye. I really love these, they're so pretty. I'm not going to pop these on because I want to take photos of them first and I don't have that much time if I'm honest. But I will try and create some looks, I'll post them or pop them on my Instagram. If you want me to do a look with these, because I haven't done a look yet and I'm kind of waiting for the perfect moment to see if like I'm confident enough to do one. Let me know guys, if you want me to do a look, I'll do a look, but I just need that kind of motivation. Yeah, I am loving this whole range. I think my favourites from the whole range, from appearance wise and from trying them out in front of you, is birthday suit, new chapter, new chapter, I can't say it, birthday suit, new chapter, and Martha Moo. Martha Moo is the name of Tanya's dog and that's what this lip gloss is, or who this lip gloss is named after. So they are the three items that I am most excited to wear, try and use, but in a completely whole different sense, I am loving this whole range. Not too keen on puppy paws, but I will try and make that work. Thank you guys for watching, if you like this video please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I love you guys, I really do appreciate everything that you do and I really appreciate your comments. They are making me so happy and they are boosting my confidence as well. Thanks for watching and I will see you again next video. Bye guys! Is piggy bank, piggy. Piggy, I can't even say it. Oh, and there's like little bubbles in the glass. Hold on a sec, someone's coming upstairs. Or oh, they're not. I don't know. Love your laps. Okay, let's do close ups because we need to do that.